Hello and welcome back to more Let's Play Bahamut Lagoon Blind. In the last one, uh, we started this fight, and um, now we're going to finish this fight. It'll be the first time in my life I ever finished a fight. No, I'm just kidding. Actually, the <laughs> the only actual fight I've ever been in in my life was not even really a fight. I was in sixth grade, and I don't know. I guess I guess I was like a pre-teenager. So maybe I was just, like, testing my limits. I don't know what the deal was. But, um... I forget exactly what happened, but there was... It was... There was, a, there was like, what? Three classes in my sixth grade. It was a kind of a small um, school that I went to. Uh, there was three classes, and then we would, like... Periodically, we'd switch to a different class for different subjects. Just to get us used to, like, switching classes. And, um... Are you gonna... Okay. Oh, look, you did some damage against the big boy, Mr. Miss... Uh, yeah, he was the dude that kept freaking missing in the last one. Anyway, um, and yeah, so, like, I was kind of a, I don't know, nerd, I guess? I don't know. Like, I, I was, like, friends with, like, two people. Okay, well, hold on. Okay, I can't do anything with him except attack. Let me just get my bearings. I gotta remember what's going on. Okay, so let's go ahead and kill the, um the dude with 700 left because the uh oh shit i can't um okay let me do the person's turn who has power eagle and maybe they'll move uh okay i can black magic them what were they weak against they were weak to ice weren't they yeah i think they were weak to ice or weakest to ice they were the least resistant to ice they weren't even really weak to it Holy shit, only regular 64? Golly, that was fucking shitty. Okay, anyway, now that I demonetized the video in the first two minutes, golly. Uh, anyway, oh, 9.99. Hey, pretty good. Good job, dude. Uh, I forget exactly. So there, there was like, I was sort of a... I wasn't a nerd per se, but I was like in the category of not... I don't know, man. My sixth grade was class was kind of a weird mishmash of people. Um, okay, do I need to heal? So, I mean, I wasn't, like, popular, but I wasn't, like, picked on too much either. But I wasn't, like, I don't know. Okay, hold on. Let me just, I don't want to fudge this up. Basically, what happened is that one of the, like, I'll just, I don't know, I didn't know him that well, but I pretty much knew that he was, like, a nerd from one of the other classes. Uh, I guess we had, like, recess together, like, all at the same time. And he... I forget what the circumstance was, but basically he threw, like, a like a basketball or a dodgeball. He just, like, like chucked it at me. He just, you know, like, like you know how, like, when you're playing dodgeball, you just, like, throw the ball as hard as you can at somebody? He, he did that to me, and I don't know why. Maybe he was testing his boundaries, or I don't know. Or maybe he figured that I was a safe person to hit because I wasn't going to beat the shit out of him. And, um... Uh, okay. Okay, let me just see who's got the least HP. I just want... I, like, I just don't want to, like, miss key is all I'm doing. Alright, let's attack this guy. Maybe we can kill him this time if nobody misses. Somebody's going to miss, though. Watch. You will. Miss. You know you will. Basically, he, like, beamed me with, like, a basketball or something. It hit me right in the fucking nuts. And, um... And, yeah, so I do the classic, like, hunch over uh, thing. And you do you do the thing where you turn Chinese for a second. And you're like, oh, you know. And, um, he fucking laughed at me. For some reason. I mean, I guess, it, I guess a guy getting hit in the nuts is funny. But, like, when it's in real life... You should maybe just at least pretend like you're, like you care or whatever. And uh, he just fucking laughed right in my face. So I guess the nut pain must not have been that much, that badly or whatever. So, oh, excuse me. So I just like, I just ran up to him and just like, I just, you know, in my mind, I speared him <laughs> to the ground. <laughs> but what probably actually happened was not that at all. But basically, I did sort of, like, shoulder charge him. And we were, like, rolling around on the ground. And neither of us were, like, fighters. So neither of us, like, actually, like, you know, we weren't, like, doing, like, ground and pound or anything. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to tell a story while 
I want to run low on HPs. Okay, I think everybody's good. I just, you know, when I have a person who can heal, I don't, I don't want to like waste their turn. Oh wait, I guess technically she can barely heal. Okay. Okay, I can summon again. Should I just summon? Can I summon here and hit? Ugh, I can't hit both of them. Well, would it be better to like just step back and um, I'll take a step back and um, javelin just for free damage, I guess. I don't know. And we were just kind of rolling around and we were just kind of like struggling on the ground, like like you imagine like two nerds. I wasn't a nerd, but like we're in that sort of like category of like not aggressive males at all or whatever, like people that would normally not be in a fight. And, uh, yeah, we just did, did that for a while. And then finally, the teacher came up. His name, <laughs> my, my sixth grade teacher was, um, named Mr. Strimple. And, uh, yeah, you just imagine what a person named Mr. Strimple would look like. And that's exactly what he looked like. Um, okay, so I can, okay, so I can heal with this party. And I didn't get attacked, I don't think. I think we, I think actually, I think we're good. I think we're in mop-up mode. I do want to get this guy day odd. It would be nice if they would move closer to each other. Oh, fuck. Oh, can I move her back? Okay, I can. Shoo. Okay, so I can reach this guy with the ice javelin. And he said something. I, f ugh, I forget what he said. He, he like, bro, he, like, told us to stop or whatever. We stopped. And then he, I think he, like, mentioned, like, suspension or something, because we were fighting, but not really. And then, like, at the end of his, uh, like, talking to us that he was giving us, he was like, and you can both come in at noon, which basically meant that instead of going out for recess, you just sit in the classroom. And then, um, that's, like, your sort of punishment, but, like, without really getting, like, the office involved, you know? Or maybe they were... I think if you... I think, like, if they said come in at noon, I'm not sure if the office was involved. I think the office was supposed to get involved if you just, like, refused to come in at noon or whatever. Uh, that was during lunch, obviously. And, uh, and neither of us, neither one of us did. And then nothing happened. So I guess they must have... Now that I think about it, I guess that was a good, like, judgment call. Like, I look back at it, it was like, oh, they had no spine, they didn't follow through with what they said. But now that I think back about it, just now, actually, um... I was like, I guess they knew that neither one of us, that we were both just like, neither one of us were like intending any harm on the other. You know, like we were just, you know, neither one of us was, you know, like if one of us would have been like beaten, like pounding the shit out of the other person, that probably would have been different. But the fact that there weren't any like blows exchanged, maybe he was like, oh, well, they don't need to, they don't re like really need to be punished that badly, right? I don't know. So yeah, that was the only fight I was ever in. There was a time where there was this, um, there was this guy who was like, he, I guess he was like a, I don't know, he was some kind of troubled kid or whatever. He was like a class clown, but there was like something going on with him, I guess. And, okay, what's the best thing to do with this person? Did I get attacked? I don't think I got attacked at all, did I? I want to make sure I wasn't attacked while I was telling my stupid story. Um, and no, I'm not self-deprecating. I just sometimes joke around about... Sometimes I make fun of myself and it sounds like I'm self-deprecating, but I'm really not. I'm just, like, fucking around, you know? Alright, I guess summon Velatora. Do your 300 damage. Velatora, you are weak as shit. I guess it's like a... It's like a large... Well, not even 300. Goddamn. It's like a... Like a like a large energy thing, so you it would stand a reason that um, because it's so large that it's not like a focused concentrated hit. That's probably why it doesn't do it as much. I don't know. Um. Okay, so we still has okay. So we're down to the, just the one dude. So we should be able to just like focus fire on that one dude. Um. I guess let's move, and I guess javelin. I guess is javelin the best thing to do. It's level 5, but it is thunder, so I don't know. Maybe the dragon, maybe this big boss dragon or whatever has, like, a different weakness. All right, there we go. Two hundo. That was almost as, as much as Valatora. Damn. Oh, frick. What was I saying a second ago? Please bite him. 
Okay, well, hopefully this will do more than 300. All right, good enough. Oh, dude, can you use Ice Breath? I didn't know that. All right, 300 ain't shit. Okay, he might need a heal, though. Uh, not yet. Um, I think we're good to go for damage. I think we can, um, I think we can, uh, go ahead and just focus on, uh, damage. If somebody goes, like, under, like, if a dragon goes under, like, a thousand, I guess, then we'll heal him. Oh, he's down to, okay, shit, yeah, he's almost dead. Oh, I was about to say, what are you doing? Oh, man, he's got level two electron. I guess it's better than nothing. I feel like him going up it like, I thought he would go up and bite when he couldn't, uh... Oh, I can't go up a step from here. Gosh, dang it. Um, okay, I guess we will just... Can we summon again? Alright, Q. I guess, I think summon's the most damage we can do oh, with this party. Alright, whatever. I wonder if I put the two summoners together, if they'll do more damage with their, with this summon. I wonder if we're ever gonna get, like, another summon. Is there is it gonna be one of those situations where there's only like three summons in the game? I wonder. I say one of those situations, like I mean a situation. I don't think I've ever seen a game where that lets you summon, but there's only three. But it would, I guess, make sense. They are kind of making like a big deal about the one summon, so maybe there are only gonna be like three. Maybe there'd be like two, then like a secret one, maybe. All right. Anyway, we did it. Woohoo! Oh, what was I? What was I saying a minute ago? I don't freaking remember. Something about people fighting, I guess? And that we didn't need to be punished? Yeah, I don't remember. Exper experiments, ex experiment. Experience bonus for all. I wonder if, um, Salamando doesn't get experience, does he, right? I feel like he was pretty darn strong. I guess he was strong for a while. I guess the other dude's caught up. It seems, I don't know. Like, in the very beginning of this game, Salamando was like the fucking man. Then he was the one that died. So sad. Um, okay, I guess save, sure. Mahal, the continent of miracles. Okay, is that kind of spoiling what the next chapter is going to be about, don't you think? Oh shit, now we're going... Are we going in a different direction, or is the, um... Is the camera just in a different place? God damn it, Lakitu. Pick one spot and stick with it. At long last, I have returned to Mahal. Is everybody all right? I don't know. Didn't you see us all survive the dragon attack? I guess that means we're, we're all right, doesn't it? Uh, I can never forget what happened on that fateful day. The day I fled from Mahal. Pussy! 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 Just kidding. He probably had to, like, f like flee to, like, fight another day. Lestat. Okay, is this going to be our new villain? I wonder. This is what awaits Mahal at the hands of I, Lestat. Oh man, your mom, your mom named you that. Golly, no wonder he's all pissed off. What's wrong? Come out, Mahal army. Come out, Captain Taicho. Hee hee hee. Oh man, reminds me of uh, Kefka from Final Fantasy VI. Oh shit, was he like the king of this uh, kingdom or something, or is this is he just aboard a ship? Captain, it is now only a matter of time until Mahal is destroyed. If we don't do something, Mahal will be laid to waste. Captain, please give us your orders. Y my orders are for y'all to shut the fuck up and let me think. Hmm, very well. I shall challenge Lestat myself. You, you all stay behind and cover me. Uh, don't be reckless. You'd only be headed for a quick death. My orders are for you to shut the fuck up. Captain, please wait. We will cut in and attack the Vanguard. That will be your chance to attack Lestat. Quiet! Who is giving the orders here? Exactly, jeez. I am Taicho, Captain of the Army of Mahal. But... Oh my gosh, you're, you, you're lucky you weren't like slain where you stood, sir. I said quiet, I am a warrior. The most important thing to me is the people of Mahal. I have no regrets in giving up my life to protect them. But, well, you can protect them better if you're alive, I guess, right? Darling. Uh-oh. Celine. Oh, that's a cute sprite. Oh, man, check out that hair, man. That's sexy. Oh, she's a cutie. I think I like her. I agree with them. 
What are you saying? If I do not spare my life to preserve Mahal, just who will? I'm only saying that you're not strong. Oh my gosh. Well, now he's got to prove to her that he is strong enough. Lady Celine, what are you saying? Well, he can't even hold me down in the bedroom. Therefore, how str like how strong could he possibly be? H how rude! Are you saying that? Uh, are you saying there is someone in Mahal stronger than I? I'm the finest warrior in Mahal. If I must forfeit that honor, I may as well forfeit my life. Sleep? What did he? What happened? Uh, Mahal will certainly lose this war, but even if we lose today, the day will come when, uh, when we destroy the Empire. Did they put him to sleep? Is that what happened? Until that time comes, please stay alive. Yeah, I sort of... yeah. Let's go. So he fell asleep like a puss, and didn't get to die honorably. Alright, I guess it's better in the long run. Gunso, please stay behind. Take care of my husband. Yes, ma'am. They should have had the sprite's eyes closed, at least, right? Here I come, Lestat. Okay, what does she think she's gonna do? Is she like a mage or something? Flame gaze! Are we gonna get a, a glimpse into what is the stronger fire move than flame gaze? That won't work on me. Murton! Yeah, by the way, was there... Did Murton... Oh, shit, I always forget. I've, I, I've never been 100% on this. Was Murton a spell that you actually learn in Final Fantasy VI? Or is that just something that the Emperor uses on... Well, okay, spoilers for Final Fantasy VI. Is that something that um, the Emperor uses on Kefka that you don't ever get to use? Where's Taito, the best warrior in Mahal? Actually, like, I feel like I've asked that, and then... I don't remember if it was ever confirmed or not confirmed. Yee-hee-hee! Hi, Joe, why... Or did you get scared of me and run away? Did the best soldier in Mahal chicken out? Oh, man, he's totally like Kefka. No, he's not like that. Yee-hee-hee! Oh, but he is! Hee-hee-hee! Die! Oh, shit. Two, uh, red triangles. Oh, man. How can Celine withstand that? Uh, oh, man. Did she disappear, or did... Like, the scene changed, and she just... They just got rid of the sprite because the, they were blacking the scene out or whatever. I, I could not protect them. My hometown, Mahal, Mahal Palace, my subjects, and my beloved wife. No shit. I could not protect them. Pussy! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I could not protect a single thing. Well, you were, like... You were, like, magically put to sleep. I mean, I guess you could have, like, resisted the sleep spell, I guess. I am sad! Man, you don't, see, you don't see that sentence with an exclamation mark. That had like four exclamation marks, I think, didn't it? Excuse me. Thomas, is there somebody you love? Is there somebody you have to protect? Uh, yeah, it's called the YouTube algorithm. Um, yes. You have to upload every day or else the YouTube ag algorithm doesn't like you. Uh, Thomas, you are a man of happiness and you cannot say certain words too many times. Or else uh, it'll like not show your videos to as many people. Uh, yeah, it's kind of, I don't know, it probably sounds weird to people that don't, like, understand the algorithm, but, like, I've watched videos about the algorithm, and it basically said, I mean, they said it themselves, that, um, when the adpocalypse happened, and that's probably one of the words that you're not allowed to say, if you say, if you swear too much, or if you say certain words too many times in a video, it'll actually, like, hurt your rankings in the thing where it, like, shows your video to people under, like, the suggested feed or whatever. Uh, if you were to lose her, that would be the worst thing in the world. If that happens, you too might become a coward of a man like me. Oh, come on, man. Oh, you're not a coward. You're just susceptible to sleep spells. There's no shame in that. But, uh, yeah, so, I mean, like, you, you can say, like, nobody's ever, like, they're so vague with, like, oh, is that raining out? That's kind of a cool effect. Hmm, it seems we've made it to Mahal. You, you can say, like, you can swear, but if you swear, like, too many times, then the algorithm starts to not like it, so to speak. Taito seems quite anxious. I can't blame him. Mahal was also destroyed by the Empire, and Taicho was known as the finest soldier there. Kana's best soldier. Hey, then he's the same as me. His pain is the same as mine. Well, nobody's pain is exactly the same as somebody else's pain, you goof. 
Uh, yes, yes. When the Empire attacked Mahal, they fought dirty. What should we do, Thomas? We might have to fight dirty, too. What are you saying, Master Sendak? Even if we fight dirty, we must fight fairly. That is what it is to be a knight. Yeah, but losing is also not what it's like to be a knight. I'm getting on a dragon now. Okay, Mr. announces everything he does. Uh, we do not know how to fight dirty. Uh, okay, so this is the feedy dragon dude, I guess. Since you're about to take off, will you buy something? Um, sure, I guess I've got money from the last fight. Oh my gosh, so many things, man. Um, I kind of wish that it would just tell you what the attack was. I'm assuming this is better because it's stronger. Recovery staff. I'm guessing that that would only be useful if you were to be in that, like, if you were to, like, physically attack them and then you could use the drug rod from inside, like, the, like, the, like, the, um, oh, what do you call it? Like, the thing where it's, like, you're on one side and, and the enemy's on the other side? What the hell is that called? Uh, anyway. Um. I wish it would show you, like, the number of characters. It says classes that can equip, but it's, like, how many of them, like, for example, how many of them do I need to buy? Um. Okay, let's cut for a minute, and I'm just gonna, um... Well, goddamn, do I even need to cut? I have so little money. Uh, Death Affinity Spear. I kind of feel like I'm not using spears that much, because the people, the parties that have lancers in them, I'm just using magic in. Well, I guess I did use... I did use it in the last fight. I can hit for two squares or whatever. I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna, um... Oh, actually... Maybe I should... Okay, hold on. Alright, hold on. Okay, so Rush... Oh, yeah, see, yeah, I learned the name. Oh, I'm getting smarter. Okay, so whatever ru class Rush is... And, um... And main dude can... Okay, so Knights and Cross Knights... I'll buy one of these. I don't want to waste, like, all my money... On something that only one party can equip. I've all got Ice Brands. Um... Oh, jeez, I got this one, too? Where, I don't even know where I got this sword from. It's even stronger than this one. I get more attack and more magic. Should I put the best thing on dude? Or should I put the best thing on other people? I don't know. I feel like having the the uh, the best thing on the strong dude, it's like that just makes it suck more nuts if he misses. So I'll put the, I'll put the two flame tongues on you, and I'll put the... Um, the spark blade on you. That way everybody gets a boost. And everybody's attack is about the same. Yeah, I know it sucks. Rush is showing up the main character of the game, but whatever. Uh, actually, maybe I should just... Like, did I get anything else? Okay, nothing's gonna be stronger than Metalite armor. Yeah, I guess I've been, like, getting shit as I've been, um... As I've been, like, fighting... Okay, let me just double check all my shit. It should only take a sec, I hope, right? Okay, Mini Devil can't equip anything, you suck. Uh, oh, jeez. Look this, Flame Mail? Fire Elemental Heavy Armor? Um, I'm guessing that... Should I put it on Thomas? I'll put it on somebody who has, like, the, like, lower defense. I'll put it on you to help you out. There you go, dude. Okay, so priests don't have anything better. Wizards don't have anything better. Heavy armor doesn't have anything better. Lancer doesn't... Oh, wait. Oh, jeez. Got a bunch of those. I don't think I had that. Did I not have that after the last fight? Is that why I didn't put it on? Okay, so from here, what do I need to buy? Um... I feel like buying... You know what? I'm gonna buy two of these. And I guess that's all I can afford. Okay. I figure my uh, my heavy armor dudes or whatever ought to be freaking strong. Like, this party ought to be, uh, ought to be good in terms of damage. Like, that's their whole purpose. That was a big boost, by the way. I feel like uh, they they should be... Um, because that's their whole purpose, 
is to be strong physical attackers that they should have the the uh, the shit for that. I guess the ice rod would maybe increase the dude's magic a little bit or whatever, but I don't know. It's too late. I already did it. Um, vitality. You know what? Ice. I don't think ice dragons ever freaking died. You seem to die a lot. Let's give you something that increases your defense. Uh, I've got plate mails. Okay, 42. Um, okay, is that good? I don't know. Let me just see how much one of these goes up. Uh, by two? Okay. Let me just, uh, check the other Durgans. Who else has been, uh, having a hard time staying alive? I think just the, just Salamando, I think. Oh man, you've got zero defense. Okay, we gotta give you something, right? He didn't die in the last fight, but if he's gonna be, like, running up and attacking, he should probably have some. He also didn't have any vitality at all. His loyalty was probably pretty low, too. It's still only at 13. Let's give you all five of the leather armors. And also, he's new, so maybe he started with, like, not very much stats or whatever. Alright, feed it up. Um, no, what else should I give him? Which, um, oh, I was about to say, which which dude is this? But yeah, he's brand new, so yeah, I don't know. I don't, like, I don't know what he's all about. He doesn't have, he doesn't have any elemental shit except a little bit of the flask bottle one. So, like, I don't know what I should be giving him. Like, what are his moves? Like, what is he... Like, what is his, like, role? Is he, like, attacker or, like, healer or, like, what? I don't know. Why do I have 31 handmade cookies, by the way? I'm pretty sure I didn't buy that many. Uh, that did go... It did make a bunch of stats go up. There was a stat that was at 94, so maybe that max is at 100. Okay, yeah. I didn't want to give him too many. Botched cookie. Okay, this might lower something because it appears to be like a failed cooking thing. Oh, jeez. Minus 15. Goddamn. Um, okay. Uh, I guess I got a bunch of these. I don't know. This will probably make us... Oh, didn't even make his fire grow up. Okay. I guess we give him, I guess, what? Two more? If each one is giving him five intimacy or whatever. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, well, Thomas, shall we go? We just talked to the other guys. Captain Thomas, I've come up with a plan for Mahal. Would you like to hear it? Uh, sure. Let's take a look at the map of Mahal. Actually, I ought to do that. This is a map of Mahal. Oh, shit, we got a different uh, thing. This is kind of cool, actually. Okay, so there's going to be a lot of... There's going to be a big battlefield... We know that a large floodgate that's currently not in use. So we gathered the enemy down in the flood basin uh, below the gate. Then we open it up and let the torrent take care of them for us. Uh, how do we do that? How do we lure them down there without putting our own guys at risk? Uh, I don't know. But they showed us that, so that must be important. Also, I forgot to look at... Um, Forgot to look at armor. I don't think I can afford anything. I already wasted all my money. Um. Okay, I think this is a better rope for everybody. But, uh, or for the mage classes. But I can't afford any of them. And I kind of don't want to sell either. I feel like anything I sell is shit that I could be, like, feeding the dragons to make them better. Because they're, they're pretty useful. I don't know. Alright, what do you got for items? Uh, we got high drugs. They're like 2,000 apiece. Golly. I guess at some point that's going to become affordable, right? Uh, okay, I guess, uh, I guess we're done. Let's freaking go, son. Uh, I forgot to see if I was going to need to change the formation, but actually, I don't know. I think we're, I think we okay. Um... I don't know, maybe I'll change, I don't know, maybe I'll, I'll think about it off camera and maybe I'll change something, maybe not. But uh, we're at an episode, so in the next one we'll go ahead and start this fight, we'll probably just do half of it. Uh, so this fight might be a big one, so it might take two episodes or more than, you know, episode and a half or whatever. So in the next one uh, we'll do this fight, and, um, and yeah, we'll do this fight. So yeah, thanks guys for watching, please like this video if you liked it, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care, bye.